So today's video is actually going to be pretty simple. Uh, this is something I kind of run into quite often. Um, for me, I purchase a lot of things from pawn shops, from Goodwill, from thrift stores, anywhere else. And then occasionally, sometimes on Craigslist or any of the marketplaces. Um, and this is mainly, or well, this is for Nintendo products. A lot of them, uh, the smaller, like the one we have today, the 3DS, uh, the new 3DS XL. This one comes to us with parental controls that we obviously don't have control over because the parent who put it in uh, obviously didn't attach it anywhere. So we got to figure that out. Um, so after trying the original, the main things, which is trying the simple ones like one, two, three, four, zero, 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 one, 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 um, and you find that you can't do it. Uh, there's actually a simple way to do it. Uh, somebody has built a website that you can put in some main information into it. And then from there, it can reset the parental controls. So let's go ahead and do that today. I have uh, a new 3DS XL that I just picked up that has parental controls on it. And we'll let it boot up here. So the first thing you're going to want to do is just make sure that you get uh, the calendar date off of it first. date and time here we go today's date so it's thinking we are yeah we're correct so it's 1 5 2021 cool all right so it's going to ask us for the pin first we obviously don't know the pin so we're going to go ahead and hit i forgot we don't know this one, so we'll just hit I forgot. And it's gonna send it off to a website here, or excuse me, a web, <laughs> geez. It's gonna send it off to an email um, that isn't attached to anything that we have. So we're just gonna hit okay. So basically what you're waiting for is it's gonna tell us that we have no internet connection, uh, or it sent the email, um, and then it's gonna give us an error code here, blah, 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 blah. You're just gonna hit okay here. And it's actually gonna give us what we want, which is an inquiry number. Once you have this inquiry number, we'll go ahead and go to uh, the website here. I'll have this posted in the notes section of the video, so don't even worry about it. So here we are with this. Um, we're just gonna have it pulled up here. Um, we have a couple different options. This actually works for the Wii U, the DSi, the Wii, and then the Switch itself. We have it through the 3DS, that's fine. We just want the date. It has it actually correctly here. It's January 5th, perfect. Um, we don't need to do this one because it's just for the Switch. And then we just want that inquiry number. So the inquiry number is going to be put in here in 3989-831-0. And then you're just gonna hit go. And it's gonna give you a master key here. So the master key is gonna be 24313. So on your 3DS, you're just gonna hit okay. It's gonna ask you for that master key, 24313. You're gonna hit okay. Master key is gonna be confirmed here. You're just gonna hit okay. And then from there, you're just gonna choose a new pin. And we're just going to do it one, two, three, four. Um, you don't have to do this step. You can, you can do it without resetting it. All right. And that is all there is to that. It's very, very simple process. This is very handy though. If you're getting consoles secondhand from pawn shops or anywhere else. Uh, this gives you the, the opportunity to factory reset everything back without having to figure out what that old pin is. Um, there is an option to actually do this through Nintendo. You just get to that inquiry screen, get that inquiry number, and then you'd call Nintendo and then have them unlock it. I believe there's a small fee for it. Um, I can't remember how much it is. But I, I think it's small, but honestly, why wouldn't you just use the webpage? This is super, super simple. So. Well, cool, guys. Thanks for watching. Check out any of my other videos if you haven't already and subscribe if you like my content. All right. We'll catch you guys later.